would pass over them. Today and for seven days, we sit in remembrance of this glorious Passover. But there is another reason we have gathered tonight. Verily I say unto you, one of you shall betray me. What? what? No. Master. No. Earlier in the garden, my father spoke with me and told me that one of you that dips in the sop with me shall betray me. No, Master, it's impossible. Everyone at this table loves you. Do you call my father a liar, Thomas? No. Master, who is this traitor? Is it me, Master? Is it me, Master? Who would do this? His hands are indeed at this table. Whoever this traitor be, let him reveal himself now before any harm comes to our master. For soon I promise you, that man by whom the Son of Man is betrayed, you wish he had never been born. How do we know the traitor isn't you, Peter? Peter? Me. I question you, Thomas, for whom it came so hard to accept the Messiah. Do you really wish to kill me, Peter? Master. Please stop this. Peter. Enough. My father shall deal with the traitor in his own way. All I needed was a little more time. But my hour draws near. We don't understand, Master. You have always been so naive, John. You will come to understand that through my death will come much life. The sins of the world will be washed away. We all love you, Master. And I believe every man here would give his life for you. Master, we have all loved you for years. What makes you think that we would ever, ever do anything to hurt you? Nonsense! Absolute nonsense! Do you think you love him more than us, Peter? Not more than I! I love him more than any of you ever will. Black Nazarene and his followers take a noisy feast. There is a reward for his capture. Come. Tell us, Master, who among us loves you more? And who in death shall be next to you in your father's kingdom? James, how can you ask the Messiah such a question? We've all been thinking about it. Whispering it among ourselves for weeks now. I think we have a right to know. Let him speak. Continue, James. Master, it is clear you love us all. But we wish to know, who is the greatest among us 12? Greatest? For who is great? He that sits at the table or he that serves. He who is greatest among you shall be the one who chooses to serve. And I will appoint unto him that servant, a kingdom as my father has given to me. After 
I am gone. You will continue to serve mankind with the teachings I have given you. Then, and only then, will you share in my glory. Remove your sandals so that I may wash your feet. Mm.